Welcome back to the balance side of entertainment, <laughs> the Good Morning Niger Show. And now we go bring you now our stories as we've been lining them up for now. The very first one now, uh, well, unfortunately, unfortunately, depending on which side of the divide now you stand. Now you remember the professor uh, from inside Obafemi Aolo University, and now he don't finally plead guilty, and uh, they don't sentence him. We talk about none other than uh, the, the one that we call Professor Akindele, um, yeah, for OAU. Now, I uh, remember the story, if you don't remember, we'll refresh your memory. And the former lecturer uh, with the Obafemi Aolo University, OAU, Ilef, uh, Professor Richard Iola Akindele, he don't finally plead guilty to his sexual harassment charges where they put against him. Now, Iola, they've been dragged and go court uh, for demanding sex uh, to award marks to one student where her name be Monica Osage. Uh, the lecturer, they've been charged him. Uh, the lecturer have been changed in plea from not guilty to guilty. And uh, yesterday will be Monday, now he's been changed this particular plea. Now, the, prose the prosecutor will be Shogun Le Adenekon. Been tell the court, say, uh, the parties involved, uh, for inside this matter, they don't reach plea bargain. That means eventually, he don't say, yes, I do. I'm going to drag the matter again, but I beg. Let us stamp out justice with mercy. Uh, and I mean, I do this badness, but I beg. I want to punish me well, well. Punish me small, not punish me well, well. Now, they, don't, now they call plea bargaining. Now, eventually, they say, uh, he then ask the court for suspended sentence uh, for this lecturer who they talk about. Now, Justice Maureen Onyetenu uh, of the Federal High Court for inside Oshobo don't sentence this particular professor to 24 months imprisonment uh, after she don't listen uh, to the argument from both the, defender, the def both the defense and the prosecuting counsels. Now, also, we hear this particular sentence, I say, was further aided after Professor Richard Yola Kindele being plead guilty to these charges. All right, in all info, all rather, all, all um, um, how did they put and say, where you do evidence where we mm -hmm. get, we know say yes, they point to him, say you do this particular badness. It's just a very sad, the kind of um, shame where this act don't bring to himself, like we talk behind the mm -hmm. scene, to himself as a professor, even as a lecturer, and even to his family. And one thing we actually ask ourselves, this one goes serve as a deterrent to other lecturers where they demand for sex just to give marks to their students. Well, it should. But just as say okay. police catch thief down, no stop people from stealing. Um, okay. Sadly, the same way. It should serve as a de deterrent. Now, the only thing we have to talk. It should mm. serve as a deterrent. Yeah. Whether eventually it does or not, down under the hands of the lecturers as well. Um, I, I don't know as I don't feel about this matter anyway. Justice has been served, I think, basically. Now, all I go and talk at the so. ultimate, because a lot of people, a lot of people, they feel say they will sweep them on that case, yeah, just like how other cases mm -hmm. they don't sweep them. Yeah. And we can't feel say the child, the, 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 the student in question will be victimized. Mm. But so far, we see and say, come, the school actually take immediate action, they sack the lecturer, and they make sure say, come, this bad matter, we carry them in time inside court. As a matter of fact, I've been discussing this with some friends yesterday, and if anybody will decide to victimize the students, at your own at your own detriment exactly. because right now say even if you don't victimize if you look the girl one kind now you go uh, to you fear go now. To, exactly you know you go to fear and say maybe they don't victimize this particular mm -hmm. person anyway kudos to our justice system exactly. at least one thing we've gotten something right <coughs> and we hope say other schools as well things like this go feel happen make mm -hmm. that they bring and not just say lecturers they uh, you know lecturers harassing female students uh, sex for for marks oh, but even say person deserve mark and you know get them mm -hmm. You know, person pass exam, I say because of one thing, one thing, and maybe the person come up for a lecture hall, or maybe the person no do this or no do that. People could begin to get what they deserve, whether good or exactly. bad, eventually. Exactly. To enjoy more of this, our Ugonke videos when you just watch, press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.